What I'm showing you is our Wi-Fi uh, uh, combo kit, which will be coming out this summer. So this is the this is the housing, and I have the camera right here. So this is the uh, the Hero too. This is the camera that you have and that you can use. So you just take the Wi-Fi backpack. This is what it this is what it looks like, and you just add it to the back of it, and there it goes. And now and now your camera, which wasn't Wi-Fi compatible before, is Wi-Fi compatible now. And it's going to come with a little, la like the back door is going to be bigger. And so you can just put that in there and you have a waterproof uh, Wi-Fi backpack camera. So you'll be able to control the Hero 2 that you already have uh, for, with a little remote control. Now the remote control can go one-to-one -to, -one to one camera. So this LCD screen is going to be the same as this LCD screen. And these buttons are going to be the same as this buttons. So you put the, you put the camera somewhere where you can't reach it. And then you just uh, you just control it with this. You'd think like, okay, I want it, I want this shot in 1080. I want this shot in 960. I want a burst mode or whatever you want. It's right there and it's really far away from you, and you can still control it with this. The next thing that we have is the uh, is like putting one remote control with multiple cameras. So you put like you're thinking maybe a soccer game, and you put you know 20 cameras all around and you know that a really cool spot is coming. You can just turn the cameras on and there they all go. And you get that action shot from multiple, you know, from multiple places. And once you're done, to conserve battery power, you just turn them off. After that, we're gonna be uh, doing our GoPro app. And uh, what's gonna happen there is that we're gonna be able to do, um, uh, you're gonna be able to see what the camera sees. So you put the camera in a hard to reach place and you're gonna be, you're gonna see it on your iPad, your iPhone, your Android, whatever. Um, and you're gonna see what the camera sees. You can change options. You can turn it on and off. You can uh, start recording, stop recording, uh, and you're gonna be able to switch between the cameras. So you'll be see all these cameras, and you can kind of go, oh yeah, I want that one. What does that one look like? What does this one? What, what does that one look like? The other thing that we have is the dive housing. Since right now with our housing and the way that our uh, lens is designed is that when, once you put it underwater, it has soft focus. Um, and uh, we, we designed this uh, diving, diving uh, housing, so when you're underwater, it's gonna get a crisp focus. A ProTune is a new camera calibration that we worked with Technicolor to develop. Um, it's a flat color space. It uses a log encoding curve and uh, a much higher bit rate. This allows us to turn off all the in-camera uh, sharpening reduce the in-camera noise reduction, and it also records in, a, in the sensor, sensor default uh, white balance, so there's no in-camera white balance. Um, this does uh, mean that you do have to do color correction in post. To help with this, we've uh, added some features to the GoPro uh, Cineform Studio software, and it does convert this 35 megabit H.264 file, which is very hard to edit. Um, into a more easily editable format uh, using the GoPro Cineform codec. So you can actually change the color adjustment very easily and you can change the looks very easily. Here we're showing the process footage with the default uh, CineStyle look applied and we can actually wipe over here and see what the original footage looked like. Uh, the original footage is, if you didn't see the punched up footage, you'd look at it and go, oh, yeah, it's pretty good. It's not bad. You can adjust the contrast a little bit and you'd be able to use it uh, perfectly well. Uh, but, the, but when you apply the look, you get a, uh, uh, a big, you know, it punches it up, increases the, gets it closer to what you expect out of a GoPro. The package will come with a, a handful of uh, presets that have these looks and will allow you to uh, set certain color look to all your, all your clips. Uh, the files will work, there, there are standard H.264 encoding, so they will work with any, uh, any program that can read, uh, read those files. Uh, ProTune is a free firmware upgrade, and if you have a Hero 2 uh, and you download the uh, Cineform Studio software, when you plug your camera in, it will tell you whether there's a firmware upgrade uh, available and download and install the upgrade for you.